The propeller twist curve can be found right here in the curve drop down menu. And note that by default, you're given a peach hip spline with three points. And that's a relatively simple, gentle curve that goes through the root, the tip, and this three quarter position. Now recall from the design that we have the three quarter pitch set to 20 degrees right now, which is effectively feathering at zero. And if we come in here and start to change this, say by moving either the position of this control point or the value, that is going to change the way that this twist distribution is lofted while maintaining a three quarter pitch. If we go back and change that to feather, of course, it's going to lock the feather here at the root and the twist distribution will adjust accordingly as it's lofted outward. So it depends on how you want this set up. Right now we're in a piece blind, so if we brought this very, very close, we could twist it up into a corkscrew because we've made this peak here very, very, very tall. Let's make it something a little bit more gentle. And in the case of where you simply want a linear twist distribution from 0 to minus 20, maybe, you can either just convert to linear, or if you want to be very simple about it, delete that point, set these two values, and you're still fine. So that's how you can interact with the twist control curve. And really, the interaction with this window is the same as any of the others. You can split, you can add points, and you can control them with the sliders or with this window. It all works out, but that is how you can set your twist.